Hey everyone at Dickerson Fencing. My name is Erin. I'm with Duff Digital Marketing and I spoke with your receptionist on the phone last week. So as promised, I'm shooting you this short video just to give you a few tips on how to help grow your business online. And I will keep this short, but if by the end of the video you can tell that that is certainly something that we specialize in and that's something that you're interested in doing for your business, please reach out to us and we can chat. And if not, no worries. I hope you're able to take these tips I'll give you and put them into action. The only thing I do ask, if you don't mind, would just be to give me some feedback on this video and let me know if it was helpful. But the three things we'll be going over will be content, citations, and backlinks. So first up is content, and that would be considered anything you can see on your site here. It does include the words, but also the pictures and what your pictures are saved as. And Google wants to see about 1,500 words on the home page of a website. But within those 1,500 words, that gives you all the opportunity to be able to integrate in keywords that people are searching when they're looking for fencing. So your website looks great. Everything is very organized and user-friendly, um, and that's amazing. So my only suggestion would just be to get some more content added onto your homepage. We, of course, want to appease Google by having those 1,500 words, but those keywords that I mentioned are also a huge component, and they're going to help out a tremendous amount uh, when it comes to ranking. So with that being said, we'll move on to the next thing, which is citations. And citations have a lot to do with this section here. This is called the map pack. And here you all are in the second slot here. So a citation is basically your business name, address, and phone number listed in various directories throughout the web. And when I say directory, I mean things like Facebook, LinkedIn, Yelp, Yellow Pages, really anywhere else that will allow a business to enter those kinds of details. So you would want to check out where your competition is being listed and you want to grab those same listings for your business. But then you want to double, triple, quadruple where you're found. So for instance, if your top competitor online has, let's say, 10 directory listings, you want to grab those same 10 for your business, but then you want to go out and find another 20, 30, 40 places to list your business. That's going to have you completely dominating your competition in that space, but it does also help you to rank high here, and it could certainly get you to this top spot as well. So moving on to backlinks, and backlinks have a lot to do with this section. This is called the organic section, and you all are number one in the organic section, which is fantastic. I will still give you this information, though, um, because as soon as your competition starts doing anything different as far as marketing goes, that could certainly affect your rankings as well as everybody underneath you. So the way backlinks work is there is a website out there that has a link to your website, and it's pushing power to your site, but it's also potentially driving traffic to it. But not all backlinks are created equal. So let's say that you all did some work for someone who owns an ice cream shop, and they've decided they're going to take a link from their site, and they're going to push one back to your site but their link is going to be all about ice cream. So that's not gonna be very helpful. You would wanna get links from other fencing companies and have them send something back to your site and that will signal to Google that that is the industry that you're in. And because of that, it's gonna be a lot more powerful, but it's also going to be more unique in Google's eyes. And this is one of the tools that I use here. Typically, I will compare you to the top ranking company on Google uh, because that is you all. I won't do that, but I did still want to be able to show you your stats here. So your site is currently registering 60 referring domains, which are giving it 321 backlinks and getting it found for 896 keywords. All of these components are allowing 435 people to visit your website per month. So well done, that is fantastic. Um, so great job, you all certainly keep doing what you're doing and truly in order to beat out your competition online and also to keep your top spot, you just wanna make sure that you are being found in a lot of the same places that your competitors are. Um, but then taking it a step further and always kind of staying on top of that and adding to it uh, because that way you're far surpassing your competition and that's the kind of thing that keeps you at the top of that first page. But that is really all that I have for you all today. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you would like more information about Duff Digital Marketing and how we can help grow your business via your online presence, please do contact us. We would love to talk to you. But thanks again and you all have a fantastic rest of your day.